Hi, my name is Adam, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use Lee Q mode on your II-900. Lee Q mode is a mode that allows you to point the II-900 at a leak and get an estimated size of that leak. It'll also allow you to take the image that you capture and plug it into a reporting tool to get an estimated cost savings if you fix the leak that you find with the tool. Let me show you how to get into that mode. The first thing that you're going to do is turn on your II-900, and once it's on, you hit the touch screen, then you select image in the upper left hand corner, and finally select Lee Q mode. Once you see that circle populate in the center of the screen, you'll know you're in Lee Q mode and you can go capture some images. Remember, the key is to get the leak inside the circle in the center of the screen. Even if you're seeing noise and reflections or even a leak outside of that circle, you're going to see this icon above that says no target found. Once you've got a leak positioned in the center, you're going to see two things happen. One, the distance is going to populate at the top, as well as the leak cue scale. Then you're good to capture the image. As you move closer and further away from the leak, the distance value will change, but the leak cue severity scale will not change. Capturing images in leak cue mode is a little bit different than capturing images in the image mode or video mode with the II-900. Once you've got the leak positioned in the center of the screen and you've got both the distance and the leak cue severity scale populated, you're going to want to push and hold the green button and hold the camera fixed on that leak for one and a half seconds. If you have a leak positioned in the center of the circle but you're not seeing a distance value, it might be because you're too far away, the environment is too noisy, or you don't have direct line of sight. But you can still get a leak quantified value estimation by manually entering in that distance. All you have to do is push the distance icon and manually enter the value. Now that your image is captured, you can add text notes, photo notes, or tags to the image, then download into the computer and generate your report.